What's good, YouTube? This your boy. Oh, God damn, why so fat? Boy, y'all don't want to come next to a nigga. Ah, oh, that's what I'm talking about. What's good, YouTube? This your boy. Oh, welcome back to AM My Lives. Hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing all right. Today we're back with another reaction video. All right, today we're gonna be reacting to funny police encounters. The first person I've seen is a Karen. I know Karens are always there. And don't don't get it twisted. You're not just you're not the white white people are not just Karens. I see some black Karens out there too. Well, what, what would we call them? Karens for black people. Sabrina's? I don't know. Sabrina, Sabrina is a miserable. Yeah, or Nikki. Ooh, could be a Nikki. Yeah, you said Nikki. Yeah, yeah. Nikki, Nikki sounds like a miserable person. But anyhow, if you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below, show your boys some love. We on the road to 1,000 subscribers. You know, you always rocking that. Life, gang, always and forever. Whatever you say, let's get into it. Oh God, I forget to press. Forget to press the button. You want to buy rock? Rock. Yes, I went. You get your twenty dollars back. Twenty dollars. She gave me some plaster. Okay? And now you want your twenty dollars back yes, I because she didn't supply you with crack cocaine. Well, she mm -hmm. she shouldn't give me nothing. No plaster. Crack. She should have said no. I don't sell crack. This dumb bitch. I'm sorry. This woman just admitted to the police. She's upset because the lady didn't sell her. Her cocaine. I don't want to laugh because it's fucking stupid. This woman just ain't no this even worth and she called the police herself. She's <laughs> I hope they was just driving by and she said, oh, oh I hope that's what happened. She said, oh, Officer, stop, stop. You know, maybe you to you know, just spray the more she stopped the officer. I hope she didn't took her telephone. Phone. Sell your phone. Her telephone and put it to ear. Officer, I need your help. I hope she didn't do that. Dude, it is dumb one. Oh god, you just admit it. Question: Is that illegal? Can I take white people money and say I wanted to maybe I have to buy crack and that? Let me do some research. Hold on. She, she said, "Oh, something." You want your twenty dollars back yes, because she didn't supply you with crack cocaine. Well, she she shouldn't give me nothing. Yeah. She should have said no. I don't sell crack, I'm a prostitute. Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh! To a uh, possible <laughs> domestic disturbance. <laughs> wrong product. Came out of uh, male, female, and alley. Oh, 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 Move that arm. We are doing nothing. You using any drugs tonight? No, man. No? I'm, I'm, I'm a guy. I know. Okay. Say no, ma'am. La muchacha me pidió un right. Aquí en la calle que sigue. He got a right. Dinero no le di. She want a right. Dinero no le di. She gave him five dollars for the right. Ni un cinquito por Dios que no cinco. I got my twenty dollars and I want it. All right, you all ain't got beat up. Y'all is not homeless like I am. So you want to arrest me? Yes, I do, and I want my money. I want to know the truth. First you said that. Okay, yeah, okay, I'm working so what? You're, I'm homeless. Are you working right now? Yes, I'm homeless. Did he pick you up for what? Yes. Anyways, they got a disagreement inside the van over here over the amount. Okay, it was going to be $5 to $20. Can I sit down, though? Yeah, have a seat. Well, find a seat right there. That's fine. Oh, Barbara, you alright? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, as much as I try not to laugh, this woman full of the damn chill. <laughs> and then they say, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'll pay you something a day. Not for $20. <laughs> I ain't blame him. <laughs> you just get, I just get my glizzy, you know what I mean? I just getting some slob on the diamonds for 20 Nah, you a crack whore, so that's five. Who right there, all right? You all right? Sum it up, they're both drunk in public, too intoxicated to uh, make any sense. So uh, they're gonna then, uh, go to jail and sober up. Um, uh, money, um, unfortunately we're not gonna be able to give you that. This woman's still admitting to prostitution and she worried about her money? You're going to jail, shut up. Give, give him less something to work with. Agreed to have sex, Barbara, and I can't get take that money back from him. You know, both of you guys, he's going to jail too, Barbara. See you, Nate. 
Shackles ain't gonna help you. I wouldn't open the door. Hit your hand a little harder, buddy. Really is. Yeah, the uh, car in front of us was taking a gunpoint, and it was just sitting down at the junkyard down there. So we spent a couple minutes sitting in the dark waiting for it to leave, and lo and behold, our bad guys loaded up, and we we're gonna pull into the NPM at Avenue East and on Highway. Passenger, keep your hands where I can see them. Keep your hands up, face away from me. Stephanie, currently you're being detained because the vehicle that you're driving is listed as a stolen vehicle. Okay? Do you understand that? And you're telling me that that you bought this vehicle from who? Dave. Dave who? New York. New York Dave? I bought it for $200. Okay, you bought the car for $200. That wouldn't tell you something wrong with it? Yeah. Okay, but your bill of sale is where then? He probably, I probably left it there at the house. I you left know. it at New York Dave's house? I lived with him. Oh, are you, oh, okay, so, so okay. you, somewhat, what does that mean? I dated Oh, okay. And the baggie of dope under the front console was mapped. Where do you know Stephanie from? I met her in jail. In jail? Yeah, and she came and picked me up, and when she got ready to start the car, I'm like, is it stolen? She said, no, I just bought it from New York Dave, and I was like, well, you need to get an admission for it. Oh, man. Bit of bad news. The car is stolen. Look at this little boy in that situation. Okay, I'll, I'll go and I'll book her then for, for the car. Yeah, for the dope in the car. Okay, and uh, tack driving on there too. Right? And remind her that when she's sleeping with guys she's only known for a month and they sell her cars for 200 bucks, that's going to be a pretty bad deal. Supposedly a naked guy assaulted somebody and we really don't have any more information than that right now. That's just... Uh, right. Just trying to be fine. <laughs> Just trying to be fine. Yeah. The vehicle apparently went through uh, one of the walls of a, a local bar. Looks like the car hit it pretty good. I'm thinking it might be a DUI. Is this your car? Okay, what happened? I don't know. I was in the club. Where was it parked at? It was over there. Okay. And how did it end up here? I don't know. This car hit somebody. Yeah, hit somebody. Physically hit somebody. Who knows? This guy might still be around here. Do you guys have any description of the person that was driving this car? Did you see her driving? Yeah, she was driving. Right. Roger. Okay, it's not the time to cry. Were you driving the vehicle? No, it's not time to cry, man. Were you driving the vehicle? Yes or no? She played it off the boy. Is that a yes? See, now your story's making more sense. You're in a heap of trouble. You are in a heap of trouble. He got scared. You hit your boyfriend. I didn't mean to. Why did you, how did you end up hitting your, where is he? I mean, he left. Is he injured? No, he left. So it all probably stemmed from a domestic dispute that turned into you probably running your boyfriend over and backing through this business. And then you lied to us about it. Step over there. Step over there. Uh, have you had a little bit to drink tonight? Well, I can see you. You just ran into the back of a police car. Oh, you going to jail, buddy. Not until I got a car. What? Not until I got a car. I'm not sure you ran into it. <laughs> it's a white two door. No plate. An EBT card, a check cash card, a social security card. Where's your purse at? Now you're walking around Whoa. $3,500 in cash. You can't afford a driver's license. I, I just haven't gone and got that. What is this white powdery substance I'm looking at here? Baby powder. Baby powder. Methamphetamine. What you need to do right now is turn around and put your hands behind your back. What? Why do you have a loaded pistol? Tony Montana. John? She plays Starface. Dope money. This is a very large quantity of methamphetamine. Yeah, boy. This is way beyond personal use. 
Just the they get it for distribution and attempt to distribute, baby. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't touch me. No, we're not going that way. Just, just come on out here and lean on the card. Why does the nigga pen so short? No, no, just... Hey. Yeah, yeah. Did you find anyone? No, I didn't. Who's that gal on the card with you? I don't know her name. Where is she? Dave just asked me to give her a ride. Where did you meet her at? James, New York. The nigga name is New York. You're not under Just being detained until we figure out who you are. This woman ain't shit, so that's my husband's purse. And your husband own a purse. Well, you never know. Some of you think it's weird. We're gonna find it anyway, so go ahead, tell me what's in it. Oh, look, look at that. Two different names. Same picture, two different dates of birth. Whoa! Two different names, two addresses. She's got. Whoa! Five IDs under the same name. Different driver's licenses and different dates of birth. Each with a different booking number on at the Pierce County Jail. You want to talk to me about these? Well, it's not a joke because... Oh, no, no, wait a minute, stop. Two of these IDs you actually have Washington State IDs for with your photo. So it's not a joke. So are any of these actually you minus the photo? None of these. Not one of these is you. So you provided false information originally, right? Okay. Okay. Shut up, man! With your partner. Shut up! Shut up! They don't tell you arrested. The penitentiary for that. As we're driving down the road, this gentleman's flag is down and by people. Let me, let, me take, let me give you a little legal advice. Listen. I wouldn't kill anybody. Tell me. I'm not a lawyer. I'm not a lawyer. Made if I don't have a law degree. If, say for example, this is a gun. No, not, not a gun. I only use a terrible gun. This is a bag of dope, right? And okay, I look at my backpack. Say they found a bag full of dope. I don't care what they say. We found in your possession. I prefer. You say I'm arrested, right? Yes, you're under arrested. For what? For possession of illegal drugs, whatever. Okay, cool. I like my lawyer. They say, okay, were well, you gonna sell it? I would like my lawyer. They send it to the bank. You gonna sell this cocaine too? I want my lawyer. You gonna sell this weed too? I want my lawyer. I plead the fifth. I plead the fifth. They found a, they can find a whole bazooka in the bag. I plead the fifth. I done arrested. What the hell are you still talking for? Listen, they can say, this phone is stolen. I plead the fifth. I don't care what they find in that backpack after that. What? You don't tell me I arrested. I plead the fifth. I need to give my lawyer something to work with. I know all the evidence pointing to me. I was the only person in the car, but I plead the fifth. You don't get me snitching on my own, so hell no. I'm stupid. And I don't have to worry. They don't get all the evidence on you. I plead the fit. I haven't talked to you all. Sure enough, I think that's it. Get your arm behind your back. Put your other arm behind your back. Put it down. Put it behind your back. Don't. Ooh, watch out. Watch out. You want to fight? Go on. Stay down. All the pain you. All right. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just had to say it. Possibly so, but you got to do what I'm asking you to do, man. But I had one I was fighting with, and the other one bolted. I ain't gonna lie to her, bro. She manhandled you. May have traveled north down on New York. The right skinned black man was. She had to be like a man just now. Took him to a motel somewhere on seminary. Right. And in her own words, tried to get your booty. Is that what she said? Yeah. And uh, okay. they didn't want to do that, so when he went. Oh, hell, hell no! To go get a room. The bottom of your feet, black. In her own words, that's when she stole the car. Okay. <laughs> What does she think she's doing? I don't know. You're so stupid. Back up! Let me see your driver's license, please. Do you have hey, insurance? Y'all remember those doors that used to open and close with your seatbelt? Y'all remember those? That was the stupidest invention ever. Stupid. You tell me you can't get on my. What if I get in an accident? I can't come on my seatbelt. Why? Because the damn door opened with the jackasses. That was stupid. No, no, no. I don't know who thought of that. Okay. 
I'm a oh, stupid. The reason I so stopped right the reason I, I stopped you. Now, I got that card from my husband, so. Okay. And I'm sure that you know that, right? Uh, no, I sure don't. Why don't you should take your hands out of your pockets? Or at least show me you don't have a weapon in them. Yeah, I'm so sure I'm carrying a weapon. Well, I don't know that you are. Take your hands out of your Thank you. Let that be low, J1. J Connor to get six one shots in his chest. Is there some right. way that I can help you? Yeah. Write the ticket. This is a traffic citation for yes. follow too closely. Okay. Alright. Yes, that's why it turned off. Remember that when you're in court. Okay. Okay. Well, she was obviously upset about something. She was driving erratically speeding because something was upsetting her, but then I think when we stopped her, it just made it worse. What? Pull over. Tell them we're pulling over just before McKinley. The vehicle stopped and we're about the 600 block. The car is reported in a stolen car. Okay. Well, we'll discuss that in a minute. I want you to come over. Go ahead and stand up. Where'd you get the car from? From Felicia. Who's Felicia? The owner. She's the owner? Yeah. When did you get it? Um, two days ago. Two days ago? Yes. Did she say you could have it for two days, or did you just keep it for two days? She let me borrow it. She said And what was the agreement when you were going to return this car? I was going to just uh, get it and then bring it back. What's this? Oh, you're going to jail. I hope you know. Oh, you're going to jail. I just got my stuff back. You just got your purse back? Somebody else wearing it? Ah. So this one's right out in the plain view, right out in the open. I know, but I just got picked up the car. I just picked it up. When well, I was who had it? Somebody stole it from you? Yeah. So this car has been stolen twice now in the last two days. <laughs> Do you really think I'm buying any of this? I don't know. Probably not. No. You're going to jail. Those tags are expired for about a month. So I'm at six traffic. I have to you got a marijuana pipe sitting right there in plain view, girl. What are you doing? She wildin', wool. Pretty stoned. Is that why you forgot to hide it? Can you turn the car off? You sure there's nothing else in there? Because I'm going to go look. If you're lying to me, you're going to go to jail, and I'm going to take your car. No, there's nothing else. Okay. You're going to jail, and you can take your car anyway. You think that nigga can stop the whole crack pipe? Never mind. And a straw. Oh, so you're not only smoking speed, you're snorting speed. Well, maybe coke. How much is smoke? Who's going to speed and coke? Nothing really. Is there a difference? Like, don't How often do you use? It's like, the first time. Do you know what this stuff will do to you? I mean, you must know what it'll do to you. You're using it, right? So you, you research it, you know what's in it. I mean, this is some bad stuff. You know you're going down the wrong road, right? Yeah, and then the end of that road have a jail cell with it. She hates it and she never wants to go back there again or she's gonna, yeah, it's not so bad, I don't mind this. stupid people around this world. America, I love you guys. You guys give me a lot of entertainment, man. I'm in a cap, yo. Some of the shit y'all do is maybe be like, but why though? Why would you not hide your crack pipe? Right? Why? Why would you not hide it? You know, something basic like that. Why would you carry crack and co crack and weed and cocaine? On you? Whoa, 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 why? You can't leave that shit home in the crib? Come on. It's not that serious. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. If you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below. You know we always gonna rock that live gang for sure, for life, for good. Until we meet again, you guys, just be happy to be blessed. But be happy, blessed, and remember, the world is yours. Peace. I'm out.